I think so far uh, for early, uh, for it being early, um, it, it's okay. We still have a lot um, to get used to. I mean, it's, uh, you know, the same system, but um, d implementing different um, different pieces, of course, out there and um, different plays a little bit and, you know, reading and reacting to each other. It's going to take some time, but I think uh, from the first uh, game to today, it was a lot better. We just, um, we, we have to tighten up on defense. We're not worried about offense too much. That's going to come. Um, we just have to get those uh, rotations and coverages correct on defense, and that's going to take some time, too. How do you think Dang is doing at both ends as far as picking up the system and being where you guys need to be and fitting with some of the other guys? Uh, he's doing great right now. Um, he, he's still uh, in the wrong spots a little bit, and that's going to come with time. Uh, you know, he's used to playing a certain particular way out in Chicago, and it's a different system out there, and they have uh, different principles. So um, he's going to have to fight that when he gets fatigued or – when uh, when the game is happening quickly, uh, but um, you know he's uh, he's made uh, big strides um, since uh, since the last game. Uh, practice has been going very well, um, and guys are really picking up um, the system. Him in particular. Do you still feel confident that if you or Dwayne aren't on the floor, that they're going to have enough shot creators to create offense? If you or Dwayne are not on the floor. I think so, and it's going to come with playing together. Um, I think um, we're missing a lot of simple plays, a lot of easy opportunities to make each other better right now, and that's kind of um, hindering our process offensively. Um, you know, sometimes when you try to do too much, uh, it can hurt you. I think right now um, we've, uh, we've missed a few plays where we just had just an easy kick, and that could do wonders for the offense. Um, you know, when everybody's touching the ball and getting a rhythm, you don't need that one person to make shots. Everybody works together to do that. But to answer your question, yes, um, we just have to make sure that we do it together, as, um, you know, all five guys out there. 32 threes, is that an emphasis or just an aberration? Uh, they were good shots. I think a lot of them were good. Some were contested. Um, some uh, were one of those things where you have a good shot. We could have got a great shot. Uh, but that's going to come with time. We're going to have to feel that um, a little bit better. Um, shooting 32 threes at a low percentage. You know, that's not really what we want. We want to, of course, shoot 33% uh, or better if we're taking that many. Um, but you know, most of them uh, were open shots. They were in rhythm. Uh, we just missed them. And, you know, that's going to happen sometimes. We just have to continue to work and continue to build and, um, you know, get those legs under us and um, just really keep on uh, stepping up to the plate and shooting them with confidence. What's the biggest thing you guys have to get out of these next four matches? I think um, just chemistry. Uh, working together, uh, what we want to do, um, you know, offensively and defensively, not to keep harping on it, but, um, you know, just getting on the same page, um, talking about things that's happening out there on the court, um, just spending time with each other and getting to know each other uh, because, you know, our options are limited a little bit more in, uh, in foreign countries, so it forces the team to uh, really come together a lot more so we can use this as an opportunity to, uh, you know, get better off the court. Can this, in some respects, be like going to the base or going to the Bahamas, where it is, for the most part, just kind of the same thing? Yeah, I mean, it's, um, we've had those opportunities um, a few times, um, you know, during training camp uh, with this team, uh, with this organization, and it's been great. I think uh, we always take something from it. So um, it's kind of hard to tell because you don't know how it's going to change you as a person and as a team coming when you come back. So um, hopefully we can use this whole uh, whole process as a positive and uh, really bring something back from it. Go out there, compete every day and practice, and um, you know have a good game and come on back.